What's to crack, lads and ladies around the feckin' world? My name is DVEEK and we're back at it again with a brand new video, except this time, lads, we're gonna be checking out something fresh. And that something fresh I'm referring to is Valorant. Yes, in this video I'm gonna be checking out every trailer, every character trailer, and every cinematic that has been released to promote this game. Now, I have indeed downloaded Valorant onto my PC, but I've yet to try it out. So, the next part of this video will be, of course, my first impressions and first reactions to the game that is Valorant. So, make sure you do hit that subscribe button for part two and turn on notification bells so you get notified when that video drops. But first of all, in this part, we're going to be checking out the trailers and stuff to kind of generate a hype and excitement for it and for myself as well so I get a better understanding of what this game is all about. Now, this is done by Riot Games, and as you all know, I'm a huge fan of League of Legends, the franchise as a whole, the story, the characters, etc, etc, and this is done by them. This is the guys that are responsible for that epic game, and we're going to be checking out their first-person style game here today called Valorant. So, strap yourselves in, lads. We're going to be checking out every trailer. Leave a like if you're excited, and like I said earlier, hit that subscribe button for part two, which is going to be my first impressions and my first gameplay of Valorant. Anyway, that being said, lads, let's check out every trailer of Valorant. Here we go. All right, lads, as always, I want to say another shout out to my boy Mark's Top List, who put together another list for us today of 16 different videos. Um, I think this is in order as well. And we're going to be checking out each and every one of these trailers, reveals of characters, and all that good stuff. And there's some kind of talks as well that we're going to be checking out to do with Valorant. So, Project A announcement. This is, I think, the announcement trailer of some sort. So, let's check this out first. Here we go. All right, so is this... Hey, everyone. I'm Anna, and I'm the executive producer on one of those games you just saw, codenamed Project A. Yes, I think I remember seeing this during their stream. Here at Riot, but I figured we could also show you some. We're making new games, and this one's different, so here This, when I first seen this, I got so excited. Team. It's competitive, it has precise gunplay, it's set on a beautiful near-future Earth, and it has a lethal cast of characters, each with their own unique abilities. This is our take on a competitive shooter. Right, so this is not the full release of it, obviously. But this gave us an idea of what the game was going to be like. I get a lot of Overwatch we vibes that from just it. Like League, we're in this for years and years to come. With Project A, we're staying true. But it's also to got that kind of CS:GO kind of style gameplay we as well. The space. We want to attack shooter with more creativity, more expression, and a lot more style. In Project A, your abilities create amazing tactical opportunities for your gunplay to shine. We started with a crew of veteran developers who have a deep passion and a wide range of experience in the FPS space. But it's not enough to have the right team. We also need to solve the right problems. But what does that really mean? Well, we're all tired of seeing our bullets not register because of low server tick rates. We keep hearing buzzwords like dedicated servers, but almost nothing about low ping or how a game plans to fight peekers advantage. But with Project A, we're going big on things like global infrastructure and netcode designed to go to war on Peeker's advantage. Yeah, I've seen all of this, but it, as we it get definitely it but enticed know, my interest to the game. Critical things to get um, now let's talk about so the cheaters. So, I'm excited to see what we know you the other trailers have to really offer now lost, as well. Or if someone was running an aimbot or a wall hack. From day one, we have put anti-cheat at the forefront of our development. Yeah, because I had to install... To I forgot what it was called matches. now, but... We want to be firm in our commitment here, because this matters to us, and we know it really matters to you. And these are just some examples of what we mean when we say we want to do a character-based tactical shooter right. We're keeping the fundamentals that make this genre so, so competitive, but also bringing some new additions. Ooh. We're going heads down for a while. I like but that. Expect to hear more from us in 2020. In the meantime, keep an eye on our Riot Games Twitter feed for any updates and maybe a few cool teases. Thanks, everyone. Yeah, because they made me install. Like this was this was mandatory. This is something that you had to install. It's called Riot Vanguard, which basically stops hackers entering your game or cheaters and stuff like that. Um, which is actually really cool because that is a big problem a lot of the BR genre. Let's check out the next trailer, which is actually a character reveal, I believe. Phoenix gameplay reveal. Let's check this out. Let's play. This is Phoenix. <laughs> Sit down. 
down. Going up. Why is the trailer like this? I don't know. One enemy okay. remaining. Lunch. One drop. All right. Okay. Interesting. I don't know why the trailer. I don't think that's from the official source. It is Valorant. Why did they upload a shitty quality character reveal, man? Because they're not give us a 1080p trailer. Interesting. All right, so that was Phoenix. Let's just go back hey, and watch that again. Let's play. So he clicks his finger. He's got like some sort of fire ability. Going up. A wall of fire. One enemy remaining. One hmm. drop. I mean, that looks... He looks like a character I would use. But let's keep going. There's more characters to see here. We have Viper. Why do they have the black bars in their trailers? Whoa, is she doing that? It's like a poisonous wall. What's this? Oh, wow. That's her ultimate. It's like a wall of poison. One enemy remaining. All right, so she's a bit of a, a bit of a caustic. Clutch. Three down. All right, so she's kind of like caustic from Apex Legends. Sova, let's check out Sova. Find them. Right, we got some sort of marksman now, I think. And he's got a drone. Wait a minute, what the hell? Nailed them. But the drone can shoot. One enemy remaining. Oh, I like that. I like that. And that reveals the... Bro, did he just shoot through a wall? Hang on a minute. Does that make him see through shit? Go back here. Go back here. Look at this. Behind that. Sova can shoot through walls. It's probably certain walls. Maybe that, that round can go through walls. Um, Sova is probably the character that I'm going to choose first, I think, in the next part. This is Sage. Right, let's see what Sage can do. She's a healer. I think. No, it's like ice or something. So she gave herself the high ground. Right, go back, go back. So she is a healer. She's a support character. I like that! That she can create platforms? That's interesting. And I like how she says that as well. I'm not just your healer. Okay, cool. These characters are very cool. I like them. Uh, Jet. Right, let's try Jet. They're very, very stylized characters. Right, that's the silencer. Headshot. Nice music. What's that? All right, let's go back there a bit. Turn on that music. So, I don't know what that is. All right, so it throws like a wall of smoke or something? Or wind. And she can dash from left and right. She got a blade too. Hmm. I think there's a character to suit everybody in this. Now we have Cypher. Who is Cypher? We'll soon find out. Stays hidden from me. Nothing. This goes here. What's that? A wall. No. No hard feelings. And what does that do now? The cage triggered. Ah. Found you. Squash the last bug. Bro, hang on, go back there for a minute. So he can trigger that whenever he wants. And that's like a camera or something. And that reveals where they are as well. God damn, that's cool. I, I think that'd be a little bit too... Too technical for me and my standards. Um, Brimstone gameplay. Let's try Brimstone. I like the names. The names are very cool in this. They think I'm an old dog. 
Let's see what Brim Brimstone can do. Alright, so he can plant smoke things on certain points of the map. Right, so let's see how that works again. Let's go back to the start. Right, so he has this little device on his arm that he can actually open up a map and see the whole map. And then he can plant little smoke bombs wherever he pleases. And that heals. So that must be a healing thing. Hmm. Yeah, I'm definitely going to try out all of the characters, I think, in the gameplay um, video, lads. Just to see what they're all like. We'll probably record for a while on that one and then edit it down for you guys. Just because I want to try out all the characters and just see what they all can do. Uh, now we have Omen. So there's a decent chunk of characters to select, so there's a decent roster here. This is Omen. Right, he too can see the map. And teleport, it seems. Right, this is a very stealthy character, so... Right. Okay, that character is cool. His abilities are awesome. Breach. What's Breach got for us? What the hell is that? Holy crap! Alright. I think this might be a uh, more of an aggressive style gameplay character. Whoa. Whoa! Yeah, the Alright, so that's... He's obviously a tank of some sort. That's awesome. Breach is very cool. Um, now we have Raze. So, let me just let me just count here. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 different characters. That's cool. Alright, let's check out Raze. Let's start this party. She's cool. Whoa! Damn! I'm deprived of my Alright, Raze is pretty cool too. Now we have Reyna. Let's see what Reyna can do. I love the names and I love the styles of these characters. Give me your heart. They will cower. More. More. What is she doing? See nothing. What's that? What's the I do? All dead, and I'm still hungry. Wait, what does the I do? They will cower. More. More. See nothing. Dead, and I'm still hungry. Right, I'm not entirely sure about her abilities, but the character is cool. Reminds me of a character, actually. Okay, so those are the characters. Um, it's nice to see that there's a decent roster, which means there's a lot to choose from. But I will be playing with all of these characters, trying them all out in the video, lads. Um, so I find the one that I think best suits my style in gameplay. Um... So it's going to take quite a while and a, a, quite a few games, but I am willing to do it. So make sure you do smash that like to show your support for the video, lads. Now we have Defy the Limits. Let's check this out. Ooh, 
de uma perna só, o saci, pererê, vai dançar de uma perna só, quem tem dois, já correu, o bagulho não dá nó, já correu, 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 pra não dar nó. All right, here we go. I liked him the most, I think. She was pretty cool, too. She was one of the newest editions. Pretty cool trailer, I'm not gonna lie. Very, very cool. Very, very cool. Very stylish, stylish trailer and characters. Oh. She must have been the newest edition. Now we have the round gameplay preview. Okay, so this is going to give us a little bit more context to some gameplay. It's only 2 minutes and 40 seconds, but let's check it out. Alpha gameplay footage. All content is still in a working progress. Uh, can I get a gun? Right, here we go. Thank you. Right, I'm gonna get the orbit A again. I'll have my ult. Y'all notice? It's real quiet in here. Quiet. It's like a library out here. <laughs> oh my <God. laughs> Should we should we do it? Should we do it? I think Kuzi gassed himself out. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes it happens, you know? Okay. That's that garage. That garage, yeah. You and will you have to cover my body if I use it up here? Oh, nice embarrassing. Start. Nice kill the door. All right. Do you help? Nah, I'm good. That was really good. Close. All right. Oops. It definitely needs to be uh, polished, so Sin. Oh. Still. I'm gonna lean A here. You think they're coming? Locking sight. No. Pick up B. Pick up B. That's long A. Right. So these little walls and. Um, obstacles are kind of a means of blocking sight and view to your opponent. What the hell are they doing? I'm gonna drone outside of a lot just to check. Right, they're just shooting everywhere because they can't see. Yeah, okay. So you can uh, walk through, which is because it's essentially just smoke. So they're just shooting blindly now. There they are. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, you can see them now. Wow, this gets messy quick. Push him, push him, and you're dead. Fuck. Is he? Is he doomed? Oh, he got the W! Nice! The raid boss. Oh my- No, not like this! Not like this! Okay, okay. okay. Get that bolt. Thank you. Right, okay. Yeah, it seems like- Oh, shit. Hang on. Okay, so it seems that this game, obviously- I don't- Is it- It's fully out now, I'm, I'm guessing. But I'm sure it's updating as it goes on, but- um, it definitely still needs to be fine-tuned, I think. Um, it gets very chaotic very quickly. Uh, I do find the gameplay looks slow. It's not too fast-paced, which is okay. Um, so it's going to be interesting to see how this game actually plays, like, properly when I go in to play it. Will I struggle a bit with it? I'm not entirely sure how the, the whole weaponry works yet. Um, if we go back to the start here, you can see... There's somewhat of a weapon selection screen here. Sidearm, primary, 
Um, you can see your your team's loadout. It seems like it's a team of five. Okay. Um, it seems you have to purchase weapons as well. I'm not entirely sure what that means. Um, is there weapons that you have to pick up or are these weapons that you pick and choose your loadout before you go in? I'm not sure. But yeah, it's definitely interesting. Definitely interesting. Uh, Alright, so we got episode one, Ignition. I don't know what this is, but let's check this out. Is this a cinematic trailer? Attackers. Defenders. I think I'd like using Jet simply because she can move quickly. Whoa. Oh, damn, nice. Cool, cool, cool. It looks a lot better now. Whoa! So she can kind of go invisible and invincible for a short period of time. 1v1, baby. Oh, never mind. Alright, let's see it then. Oh, she can launch herself in the air! like that so it's almost like a capture the flag kind of style gameplay i don't know if there's different modes and stuff like i said never played the game don't know what i'm going into um uh, but i am very much excited okay so we actually do have a cinematic trailer it's called duelists this is our last thing to check out together lads let's do it so this is an actual cinematic trailer let's check this out I would if somebody was a little less aggressive. Hey, cool. Stop. Uh, this is cool. Stop. This is cool. I like this. That's Jet. Oh, that's how you want to play it. Ow! Phoenix just got stabbed in the shoulder. <laughs> Got him. Nice work. All right, I'm going in. What about the hostile? I wouldn't worry about her. One hundred. I got this. I love the voice acting. The voice acting is top notch, man. You were saying, bro? <laughs> Let's go. What did she say? I missed it because I was talking like a dog. Still don't know what she said. That was cool. Give me more of that. Give me more of that. Okay, hang on now. Whoa, he's like a phoenix. Rises from the ashes. <sighs> yep. Cool. Control. So about the package. What's going on? Can't wait to start playing now. Cannot wait to start playing. Alright lads and ladies, there you have it. That was the Valorant trailers from the cinematic trailer to the character trailers. Very, very, very interesting indeed. Um, since I heard about this game and people are telling me that it's actually out and I can play it, 
I didn't jump at it straight away. I wanted it to get past certain phases that the game was going through before I try it out. And now that I think the game is pretty much complete, obviously there's going to be updates happening um, every now and, and again, patches and stuff like that. But I am interested in diving into this game. And I don't know if I'll be any good at it, but I will most definitely give it a good shot and genuinely practice and try get good at it and see if I can get some decent gameplay for you guys out there um, for part two of this video. So the next video, of course, is going to be me playing the game, trying out the characters, learning the abilities, and learning how the game is played. Obviously, it's going to be a pain in the ass for any of the rest of my team that, you know, I'll be a noob. They won't know who I am. They'll think I'm somewhat decent at the game, but I'll be actually terribly and terribly shit at it. I don't know. We'll have to wait and see, but I look forward to playing it. I do. It looks fun. It's kind of reminds me of Overwatch in a way, kind of meshed and mixed up with CSGO a little bit. Now, I've never played CSGO, I've played Overwatch alright, and the characters and the way they're designed is very similar to Overwatch. Um, and the colours and stuff and all that, the style, very, very similar. But I like where this is going, and the fact that they do have voice actors for these characters, and they're already releasing some cinematics and stuff, makes this game um, very interesting to me. So I look forward to it. Plus, Riot Games are responsible for it, so, you know, I have full faith in them delivering something, and this is... Completely out of their comfort zone as well. This is completely new to the, to the game that they've already been working on for many years now, which is League of Legends. So I'm looking forward to it. This is going to be a fresh new experience and I hope you guys are going to join me for the gameplay video when it drops. Don't know when that's going to be. It may be this week, it may be next week, but make sure you let me know by leaving a like on the video and subscribe to the channel and turn on notification bells for more. But anyway, lads, I'm going to end the video here. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed, like I said, comment down below your favorite part of the video. And if you have any, any hints and tips before I go into the game, make sure you let me know as well in the comment section. i greatly appreciate it. Anyway, lads, I'm going to end it here. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, stay geeky, stay cool, be awesome, and be happy. And I'll see you dudes in my next Valorant video. See you later, dudes.